in this sleep balance sex is in one corner we have women who may or may not need something called beauty sleep and a man who may or may not want to admit that they also want something called beauty sleep. <laughs> of sleep men versus women who sleeps more according to a recent study out of Cambridge University women actually spend 15 minutes more time in bed each night but we sleep 11 minutes less than men ladies what are we doing in bed candy crush obviously oh do women make up for that miss sleep by napping more than men cat nap Again, no. A survey conducted by the Pew Center for Research found that 38% of men that they talked to had taken a nap in the past 24 hours compared to only 31% of women. Again, ladies, what are we doing? For round two of the sleep battle of the sexes, does one group need more sleep than the other? According to one Professor Jim Horn, who is a leading British sleep researcher, women, in fact, need 20 minutes more deep sleep every night than men. Because we're dainty princesses who need our beauty sleep, right? Wrong. Apparently, the multitasking female brain needs a little bit more deep sleep to rest and rejuvenate its cortex. It gets super active during the day as we're trying to quote unquote have it all. Whereas what women really need is more sleep because according to a Duke University study, in the round of who wakes up grumpier if they don't get enough Z's, Women win. If by winning you mean feelings of grumpiness, irritability, and hostility from not getting enough sleep. Is this ringing any bells, guys? Who woke me up? Where are my pajamas? If at this point women seem to be on the losing end of the sleep battle of the sexes, well, you're right, because even when it comes to insomnia, women are 50% more likely to suffer from it. Why? Hormones. Because periods aren't enough. Female insomnia is often linked to hormonal fluctuations of our menstrual cycles, pregnancy, and menopause. In other words, women can really never escape it until we sleep forever, which is death. Women are also likely to suffer from things like fibromyalgia, depression, anxiety, restless leg syndrome, all of which can cause secondary insomnia. Compounding this problem even more, some research suggests that a lack of sleep takes a harsher toll on the female body, leading to things like diabetes, cardiovascular problems, heart disease, depression, and anxiety. Thinking about this is giving me a little bit of anxiety. <laughs> but there is one area where men have it tougher, and that is sleep apnea. Men are less likely to sleep throughout the night because they are twice as likely to suffer from this condition that causes a shortness of breath during sleep, which then awakens the brain from its deep sleep, which might be why men are also likelier to accidentally fall asleep during the day. This isn't to say that on an individual basis that every woman has a hard time sleeping, that every man can sleep just practically anywhere. These are simply the overall population findings of a number of sleep studies. I think it's pretty clear that in the sleep battle of the sexes, men, you are clearly coming out on top, or at least a little bit less tired and grumpy. You win a victory nap. Actually, no, can we just give a pity nap to women? Ladies need some sleep.